All right. Sorry about that. Took a little bit longer than I expected. I'm sorry if it was uh, if it was dark for too long. My sincerest the bullets. What's up, Mama Misty? How you doing? Um, six string, the person who is in line first and requests the we copy will, will get said copy. Everybody tower. behind them is Fubo. We must defend it with all our strength. You make them play on Smash 64. Winner gets Smash Wii U and normal price. I dodged. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you! Wow, mom. Mom, do some fucking work already. Really getting tired of being the only one doing work, mom. You're not doing anything right now. Dude, if Bayonetta made the Smash roster, uh, that would be amazing. Can you imagine how badly they'd have to tone her down, though? Actually, no, I take that back. They wouldn't need to tone her down at all. They could just tell kids to fucking deal with it. See, I would like to see Bayonetta in Smash, though. Like, I feel like she would make a half-decent addition to the roster. I ran around, and that killed the enemy. Got a bronze. Still doing okay. Probably Frodo. I mean, like, if anything, I feel like she would be, like... Smash Brothers equivalent to a beautiful Joe style character. So something similar to Zero Suit, but like with two Link size. Well, not in Bayonetta's case. God, I would love to see beautiful uh, beautiful Joe in a proper like fighting game though. Or rather, not a uh, proper fighting game, but like a Smash style fighter. Because he's already in Marvel vs. Capcom. Like I would love to see beautiful Joe in a Smash style. Oh, that would be so good. That would be so good. I would pay decent money for that. She would have a mixture. She'd have like, I feel like Bayonetta could have the potential to be like the ultimate ground combat. Really, I mean, like, actually, I feel like she would be more suited to mid-air combat. She'd be the ultimate range, like range and then close, but her mid game is fucking questionable. I would love to see that as a mechanic. Holy shit, dude! Forty. See, it's working now. $40 from Source Code Pony says, Mike, I would like to thank you for being an amazing streamer in person and for putting a smile on my face. Let's go invent tomorrow instead of worrying about what happened yesterday. Steve Jobs. Damn fucking right, dude. Like, the one, the biggest disservice you can do to yourself is dwell on shit that will keep you from being able to move forward. Because, like, when you do that to yourself, it affects everything you do. It leads over into everything. 
and it leaves you feeling miserable. And it's just not fun. I'm being killed by a dragon. Hold on. Get your dragon happy asses out of here. Mom, you let them get away. God damn it, Mom. Oh, cool. I got them both. Alright. No, I don't need to die here. I'm good. Really? God damn, Mom. Mom, have I told you that you're terrible at letting your daughter die? Well, actually, you're good at letting your daughter die, but... Dude, Source Code Pony, you're beautiful. Thank you for the $40, dude. You're amazing. Which actually puts you as the top donator currently. Which updates automatically! I don't have to do sh Oh, God. It feels really nice to not have to update that stuff anymore. <laughs> Like, one of my biggest guilts on this was the fact that, like, I had no means to update my sub thing and my fucking donors and stuff like that, so I wasn't- I had to, like, I would go days at a time without updating it, because I would get caught up in the game I'm playing and just not find the time to update it. And since you can only do that from OBS side, there was, like, really no means of doing what I needed to do, so... I, uh, I finally found out what the fuck T-Notifier was, and I figured out how that worked, and now here we are. At first, I thought it wasn't even going to work, too, but I was pretty wrong. Me and Mom are just boxing champions. As the American... Dude, swear. Can you imagine? Like, think about how some things were translated during the 1990s and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Think about the way that some shows were translated. Some shows didn't even, like, get a translation. It was just all ad-libbing based on what was happening in the show itself. And so, what I think is going to be especially hysterical is, like, I want to see somebody who does bad translations for modern shit. Like, think about it. They would probably, like, in this day and age, they would say that Bayonetta is a gymnast. She's an all-American gymnast with a dream to save her father, or like her mother or something like that. And she's enchanted. God damn, I have got to stop running into that. Got to stop dying. Uh, excuse you. First off, Ghost Stories dub was not bad. Ghost Stories dub is a gift unto mankind, and you need to recognize when you've been given something when you've been given something beautiful because clearly you do not. If you think that Ghost Stories is a bad dub, Ghost Stories is the dub that we deserve. It may not be the one we need, but it's the one we sure as hell deserve. Damn it. I think the thing that people forget a lot of the time is they forget, like, the fact that there's a fine line between a good dub, like, a good bad dub and a bad bad dub. Because, like, there are some dubs where they're so bad that they're funny, or they're so purposely bad that they're comedic in some way because of the way that they time their shit. But a lot of people don't realize that... Oh, wow, did I really get pure platinum on that? Fuck yeah. Um, but a lot of people... Uh, a lot of people forget or don't realize that, like... With that kind of stuff, there is, like, 
Just because it's bad doesn't mean it's gonna be like good bad, you know what I mean? Mom, fuck you. I am leader of this pack, Mom. Move. I got two combo off that. Wow, and I got eaten. I got eaten again. Wow. Got him. What's up, Ross? Wow, red name, that's new. How you doing, bud? Uh, yes, dude. Got him, good. All right, that's where I died last time, so. Good for us. Look at that. I instantly have full. That's amazing. Oh god, I have so much fucking mana now. I'm just gonna call it mana. I don't care what it's called. Magic power. God damn it, mom. Stop being faster than me. I hate that. She's always super fast. Platinum, you're damn right. Send his ass running. Okay, that's useless to me. I did it. Okay. All right, good. Two Midas spells. That's going to come in handy later. I want to get some money, damn it. Actually, I wonder how close we are to affording that costume, because if I can get that soon, dude, Metal Witch is going to be off the chain. Or it's going to be really bad and embarrassing, and you guys will have swindled me out of uh, a whole bunch of fictional money. I'm going to be very upset with you. Shut up, Mom. I'll take that. It's not great, but I'll take it. Wait, Mom. Mom, I gotta go shopping. 
Dude, Evil Within's a good game. Like, I think it's a game that I'll probably play again sometime in the future, but not right now. Definitely not right now. The world famous Rodot, where demons and gunsmith and go together like chicken and waffles. <laughs> Sorry, I'm mad, huh? So, is the sound good for I you guys? Do? Like, is it loud enough, or do you need it to be louder? Because I want to know. Oh, good, I have enough. Metal witch, metal witch, metal witch, metal witch. Yeah. All right, good. Just me. Oh shit. Oh wait, I can't do it in game. I have to finish this chapter first. Okay, I got that. I should really just hunt down all the stuff in this game eventually. Oh, bye, kitty. Oh, uh, it's just lava. You guys, the lava is just as scared of us as we are of it. We show it that it means that we mean no harm. It'll be fine. I'm sure it's just a big old warm cuddly kitty. You don't get the chance, dude. You had your chance at freedom, and guess what? You squandered it. Going hog, dude. This guy's fucked. This guy's absolutely 100% fucked. Look at that. I don't think that was any damage. I think that was just clean. Let's find out. Hey, platinum and no damage. Excellent. All right, cool. Whew. I could have jumped backwards. Hey, didn't I die here a couple times? Walking on, uh, walking on nothing. Yep. Excellent. Perfect. We are a god. And, uh, you know, I'm not quite sure how this works, but I'm not complaining. Let's go. Come on, climb it back up, baby. Climb it back up. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on, let me get on top of this rock. Nope. You're gonna let me die? Yep. Okay. You're gonna let me die. Cool. 
they laughed. They laughed when I had said I had found a way to ascend. Who's laughing now? No, Mom. You're not the boss of me. No. Okay, now we'll go. Because I won't. Not because you want me to, Mom. Alright. Plenty of purple butterflies. I really hope the next one is filled with green, because that would be lovely. I just gave up. I was like, you know what? I'm going to die. I'm going to just die here. Might as well. There was no making it up that after a while, the seam I was on just started to level out. So there was no getting any higher than that. Oh, great. It's this one again. Wow, fuck you, dude. You know, I thought for a brief instance maybe it was gonna happen. I was wrong. Let's try actually not. Yeah, let's go. Well, it's not gonna matter, cause. No, do it, do it, do it! God damn it, Bayonetta! Now you wanna pick up the weapon? Now you wanna pick, I hate this game. Now you wanna pick up the weapon, okay. Come on. Oh, fucker. Oh no. Oh no. 
Okay, give me whatever grade I got on that, please. I don't even care. What did I get? Did I get a- I probably got a stone. Give me a stone. 